Hello everybody and welcome back once again. Here we are with another edition of Inside the Headset, Week 10, Game 10, and I'm with the head coach of the Seagull Stars, Coach Greg Wyatt. Last Friday night, if there ever was a day you could have called in sick and not reported, I'd say that would be it. it, uh, it we, it's a humbling experience. We got, we got humbled pretty well, so we didn't play very well. Um, you know, we went out flat. That's my fault as the head coach of this program. And, and um, you know, just, you're going to lose sometimes. You just hate to lose the ones you're supposed to win. Um, since then, and um, kind of, I guess, as you went back over the film, just what are some of the parts that you saw just real fast that you're just like, that's not that's not the same guys under the helmets, and that's not what we talked Well, we about. just we didn't execute some of the things that we do very well. We had way too many pre-snap penalties, which is un unexcusable. Um, you know, we went out flat. We didn't play with very much emotion and very much, uh, very much energy. And uh, you know, I think our kids got, you know, uh, I think uh, it wasn't just our kids. I think our whole program, you know, got a little uh, complacent on where we were and, and thought we were going to go win that ball game. And uh, you know, give give all the credit to Ron and, and his staff and those players. They played well. They played very well. And played well enough to beat us. It was physical. I mean, it really was. Yeah, I, I mean, mean, those kids came out and played. Um, since then, you've had an opportunity to start preparing for this Friday night, and uh, it's going to be a tough one. It'll, they'll be coming here, and uh, they have nothing to lose and any, everything to win, and, and uh, they'd love nothing more than to. Put sure, on I mean you. this is a playoff game for them. You yeah, know, this is a playoff game for them. We, you know, I think we've had a little bit more focus this week in practice. I think uh, last last Friday night got our kids' attention. I know it got our coaching staff's attention. Uh, I challenged our coaching staff. I challenged myself and. In preparing this week, so I think we've done. I hope we've done a little bit better job. Anyway, well, I just want to say that we're going to wrap it up. This is our last show. If there's anything I can do, just let me know. I appreciate you visiting with me, and uh, whether it be I'm on the road or whatever it is, you've, you've been very faithful, and loyal to uh, sitting down with me. It's your platform. It's your opportunity to uh, to talk with your fans and to say what you want to say. And is there anything else you'd like to say to the fans just about this Friday no, night? No, I mean, other, the playoffs? Uh, other than it's just it's senior night, and I'd like to see, you know, some, some folks come out and really support these kids. They've spent four years here in this program and and uh, have really worked hard to get a program to where it's at. And, um, you know, uh, and, and so uh, they need some support. They, you know, we, we want people here to support them other than they're just their parents. It, well, it'll it'll be kind of hard. Uh, I've heard Denzel Harding's name quite a bit uh, for many years, so it'll be hard thinking that when you do come back here next year, I won't be hearing his name on the, That's true. On the box. That's true. Well, let's wrap it up right here, Friday night, senior night, and uh, Siegel will not end their season there because they're moving on into the playoffs and follow them all the way through. Siegel Stars, Laverne Wolverine, 7 o'clock right here.